All right, welcome back to Foundation. This time out, Weaponsmith. But I am standing, sitting, floating, where I want to build the monastery. I believe this is it. I could change my mind again, but boy, does this view look nice. And you can see the church way over there, which is, of course, still under construction. And really, the question is, am I going to leave it alone this episode, or am I going to put it under construction before I end this one? So let's uh, let's pull out. I was sitting right here on this hillside. Okay, I think the monastery looks really good right here. Here is where the blacksmith and assorted coal coal. Whoa 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 whoa. There we go. Coal hut and everything else is. There's the user interface. Control U turns the user interface on and off. Two unemployed just arrived, and I want to fix a problem that is keeps coming up over and over again and there's a simple way to do this and I've actually messed around before recording to fix this cuz look at that dude it's personal okay it wasn't personal before now it's personal because you guys you're the iron smelter in your building over here and I've had it and I'm gonna tear down your house and I'm sorry except I'm not really sorry but my fault no more. No more. No residential area over here until I need more jobs over here. Okay? And you're gone. And you're gone. And you're gone. Every one of these people worked on the other side. Oh, you. I see that. Sneaky. You're gone. You're all gone. Okay? You can build over here where I want you to build. Alright, now. You'll see some houses crop up here. We can double check the residential area and make sure that well is too close anyway. Um, I put these wells really close and they don't need to be that close. And I want, mm, I don't, I want the residential area on this side, let's say. You can see the other barriers there. All right, and I also want the residential area out over here. And we can come down here and kind of go next to the bridge, right, and come out here. I do want to use some of these woods, though, because we need... Let's take a bite out of crime here. We need... We need wood for the charcoal. We need all kind of things. So now... Right, we're now building. And female 33, you're the iron smelter. Hey, how about that? How about that? You're finally building over here. Thank you. This will help speed up the creation of the tools. We have 55 tools. I'm buying... Uh, I put on 100 tools last episode. And no, the whole point is we make our own tools. So I'll buy. If supply goes below 40, I'll think about trading them. Otherwise, we're just going to collect them. So now I have two unemployed that can't build anywhere except where I want them to build. And so we'll go down here to this warehouse. You're the tool warehouse. And I'm gonna grab two of you to work here. And let's just check your home situation out. How about that? You're living over here now because it's the only place you can build a new house. Okay, now, second issue is that I robbed a bunch of these uh, woodcutters because they lived close to where I wanted... Here, yeah, you're almost empty. And so our wood supplies are down. And, which is, which is a negative. So I need two more. And we don't have two, so just remember that. Just remember that for me. Because I'll probably forget. Let's fly back over here now. And let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. Oh, yeah, you're assigned. You're assigned. I can have one more. One more. I can have one more coal burner. Uh, but you're just not really producing that many tools. For one thing, because you lived on the other side of the world. But let's go ahead and put in the weaponsmith. And you use. If you look at the weaponsmith here. It produces weapons for iron, coal, and tools. So being right here is a perfect spot for it. Uh, it requires polished stone, wood, and tools. And speaking of polished stone, boy, the 
the mon the monastery requires a ton of polished stone, and I'm just not making a lot of it or keeping a lot of it. It's the trader guy. How you doing? So I like the way this looks, because I like the way the road wanders off there. And you're kind of stuck right here. You're next to the well. Let's put you right about there. All right, and that's where we're gonna make our first weapons, and we'll probably need to expand this back somewhere. I've kind of already cut off the route. Maybe we'll go this way. But let me get this out of the way too. I'm going to make an extraction zone here because I'm going to be cutting these trees down. Yes. And at the same time, I am going to be reforesting this area. So this should, I hope, become a good supply for the coal huts. There we go. So we need a, a reforestation. It's not a forest station. It's a forester's camp. We need a forester's camp. And you can fit. I don't want to take any trees out for you. You can fit right in here. And then we're going to need two more lumber camps. Um, and let's... Let's put one of you right here, and I don't know, let's, let's stick another one in here. All right, so there we go. And those can get built while we're impatiently waiting. How's this market? We need, I need more villagers. Let's speed it up a little bit. My other goal is I want to get above 300 villagers. We have 93 happiness. People are, are lacking housing. Okay can't help you yet. Uh, you can build over here if you need housing. Are these guys working at all? You got one tool. Now there is one negative with bringing the tools to a central location and that is the weaponsmith's gonna have to come over here to get tools. Oh, I wanted to do one more thing. We are currently collecting tools here. No. Here. Yes. Empty this stockpile, and then we can free this up for... I think we can store more planks. And the glass here is fine. So now that we have that out of the way, I've got the tools going. Building complete lumber camp. I have two new unemployed, and I wanted to take the people that live over here somewhere and put them back in the lumber camp. I used them as miners, and like, May 1157, where do you live? Yeah, you live over in here. I'm going to put you back as a woodcutter. And you should choose... Well, I don't know, actually. You'll choose the closest job. That'll be interesting to see which one you choose. Where do you live? Same place? Alright, you're back to woodcutter. See how much woodcutter XP you have? Which doesn't mean anything in this version of the game. But, it's there. It's a bar. And you are a miner. And where's your home? Wow. All right, you are back to being a woodcutter. Where's your workplace? Okay, you're still a miner. Have you switched yet? No, nobody switched yet. So you're down in the mine somewhere. I know um, and this is not what we're here to see, but I just want to know when, when are you going to switch back? Again, my flying today is terrible. I blame the weather. So I'll just keep this over here. There they go. Okay, they reassigned to this, right? Right there. Two of them did. All right, does everybody have three? I think so. All right, so we're back to full lumber force. <laughs> what a weird, weird way to phrase it. Lumber force. Okay, good. You got a, you got a guy. Yeah. You're all, you're all numerical. And we will have two new people coming in. Let's fly back over here. How's this doing? Uh, you're assigned to construction. We just need the 20 tools. I need another warehouse because... Did one of you guys go here? Yes, one of the male 272 is now working at this lumber camp. So I don't know what you were doing before. You might have been a builder. But we have one lumber camp over here now. I want to build another warehouse over here. And I think I'm going to kind of... How do I want to put it in? Do I just want to put it in here, kind of angle it. 
angle it in there. I think they can still get around. I don't know. There we go. Okay, another warehouse. And I may have one slot reserved for tools here. So that some of our tools go here. I wanna I'm gonna wanna buy some land. Do I wanna buy this land? I don't really need to buy anything right now. But what I want to do is I want to put a market over here to pull the desirability layer over here. I'm going to put the market on the other side of these trees. I'm going to do another. We'll have to do a well. And I'll put the well, you know, right along the tree line. Let's put in a good stall. An envoy. Envoy? Envoy? And how about a uh, how about a luxury stall? We'll put our first luxury stall over here. I'm just saying in preparation so I don't have to build it later. Okay. And uh, just stay there. Hey, how's it going? I'll deploy my troops right away. Uh, it's all about the wine. And you know what's funny about the wine is that I don't have a warehouse for the wine, but it doesn't mean I'm losing it. It's collecting right here in the well, which is why everybody comes to this well for a drink because this is the good stuff here. But uh, yeah, it, it's just a small resource depot, but yep, all the wine goes there. I have no idea how much wine, well, we know how much wine we have. Uh, we have 170 and climbing. There goes the dudes right there. There they go. There they go, down the hill. Alright. So, right. Uh, what was I doing? I was putting in a market. Yeah, I said luxury. And one luxury food stall. So, what did I do? Uh, berries. Mm, bread. Fish. Uh, how about one more food stall? This is going to be the market. The place to be. And all just all spread out in a straight line because of creativity, right? And start the construction. There we go. That may have already raised the residential level. It did. It certainly did. So here's where you can build. One slot for tools at this warehouse. And the rest are going to be simply for wood. Take all the wood. There's two of you. Excellent. I'm going to put in a luxury tent here. Let's go ahead and, and expand this to edit. Luxury stall. I'm just saying this is in preparation. Okay. This is in preparation for future luxuries. Start construction. Thank you very much. All right. All right, two more unemployed, so let's get a reforester over here, which leaves me one person. And you know, I don't do enough of these low views here, because the game is so good looking, but I never get down in here and just sit and watch. I know, it's not very exciting, but at the same time, hovering at 10,000 feet, ooh, look what's finished. Here we go, let's, let's, let's zoom in here. The weaponsmith is now finished. I'm gonna go ahead and assign only one. So the odd number worked. There we go. Mail number 48. You're pretty low in the numbers for such a late arrival, but you are our first weaponsmith. And the well is complete, which is uh, over there somewhere. And we will have weapons soon enough. And our soldiers are back from a mission, so soon I will have free land. Everything is happening. Uh, how much iron do we have? Why don't you look at the list? Why don't you look at the list here? 263 iron ore. If that goes below 200, maybe I think about putting more miners in. The coal, the coal number is crap. The coal, the coal number is no good. Uh, we're not storing any wood. It's being stolen, isn't it? It's being stolen by all the builders. Like, who are you? Who are you? You're a builder. Good grief, you guys. 
you guys, I, I didn't even tell you I was building there, and somehow you just know where to where to go get the wood. I'm telling you, it's 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 the super highway here. Who are you? Your transporters. Aha! Where's your workplace? What? What? You want? No, you can't steal my wood. Way up there. What are you doing? No, 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 no. Not gonna allow it. Not gonna happen. I'm not putting wood up here right now. I'm gonna say, don't stock, don't stock, don't stock, don't stock. Believe in? I'm sorry. It, it just popped into my head and I said it. I'm, I'm done. Wouldn't it, I think it would be nice if we could set priorities on workshops. So if this fills up, we could, we could fill up the other one. This does mean all the wood goes to here. Hey, we got a free territory. All right, uh, I'm gonna buy this one because I don't like these lines. I feel like they're encroaching on my turf. So let's, what key is it, this one? Uh, buy it for zero. We have $4,000 gold, technically. Uh, I'll buy this one. And then if we think about going up the hill, if I want to build the monastery here, I'm gonna need this piece of land. We have four thousand dollars. Am I not spending this stuff? I'll buy this one. All right, and then uh, that'll be it for now. Okay, no more buying. And look at you guys building houses over here. Nice. This is nice. I need more jobs. You guys are gonna. We're we're out of work. Well, no, I'm employing you over here. Weaponsmith, you have yet to create a weapon. All right, maybe you had to go to class first. Read the instructions. I don't know. Uh, charcoal burner. We don't have any charcoal being produced. We don't have any iron being produced. It seems like a slow, slow production line. We are completely full. I thought this is now done. Thank you very much. All right, so slot one berries. Slot two bread, slot three fish, slot four venison and shirts and which one of these is luxuries? Market tender, market tender, market tender. Which one's which? I don't know which one's which. I do know which one's which from this list though. Right? Uh, so if we scroll down here, these are market tenders. Food stalls. Yes, I do. So I know from here. We definitely want to assign to the food stalls. And I'm not even going to acknowledge your existence. Here's the good stall. One good stall. So this would be for clothes. I don't have anybody yet. Maybe I do now. Maybe now. Maybe now. Maybe now. And those are the miners. And then there's luxury. Market tender assigned to the luxury stalls. So it's alphabetized by this. Okay, good stone. Yeah. You guys are producing wood. We are storing wood here. No, we aren't. Well, yeah, 34 wood. We are also storing tools here if somebody can pick it up. Uh, we have two transporters. And I think we're going to need another mm, I think we can use another iron smelter for sure because we're at zero iron so let's do that let's make another uh, smelter right there I think there you go so we'll build another one there so that should bump our iron numbers up the coal we need to bump up as well yeah we have three of these and they have 23 wood their production's just low, in my opinion. So let's build another coal hut. Yeah, I think it works here. So we'll put it right here. All right. And we now have produced three weapons. The question is... Am I going... You have nine coal. You have plenty of coal. Two blacksmith. I wonder if I'm going to need another blacksmith. I could build another one. 
because we love tools. That is for sure. Okay, there. Like I said, I, I cramped myself in this corner here, which is no good. And so what did I do? I built another iron smelter, then I built another coal hut, and then I built another blacksmith. And I'm going to keep the weaponsmith as is for now and see how much weapon production we can produce. So if the warehouse on the hill isn't accepting logs, Look at all the stone, 722 stone. I say, I say, and I remembered this before, we need another stonemason's hut. Yeah, one more stonemason hut there. I could put another stonemason hut down here. Okay. Building complete coal hut, all right. Building complete coal hut. Uh, where is the coal hut? Here it is, right here. Let's see here. You, assign available villager. How many do I have? Notice the windows are all closed again. Come on. Get with the program. You're up here. Uh, I saw Carl. Uh, oh, we got a lot. One, two, three. So, let me tell you something I've discovered that annoys me to no end. Now, I built all this all this beautiful property and these markets and everything and somebody said you know what I want to do I want to build up on the hill that's great well who's female 920 you're a woodcutter where do you work that's right you work down here but you live you live right here male 1528 where do you where do you live or where do you work same thing. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. Female 1106, where do you work? At this market way over here. So I tell you what I'm going to do. I tell you what I'm going to do. To work around this, I'm not going to tear down this house. I'm going to turn you all into builders. Okay. Did I, did I manage to do that? You're a market tender. No, you're a builder. Female, you're a builder. 1528, you're a builder. 920, you're a builder. Okay? And I will I will turn them into builders because they decided to build a house here without my explicit permission. What kind of kingdom is this? Alright? Is this some sort of democracy or something? Because I didn't sign up for that. Stonemason hut's complete. Uh, iron smelter's complete. Alright. You are our new stonemason. Where do you live, by the way? View home. Okay, now, see this? Never mind. Never mind. Okay? I, I'm picking on you. You can add one of you guys, male, you can be a stonemason. You can be the stonemason. Going to fetch some resources. Wow, popped right out of your house. All right. You're the stonemason. And you should show up there eventually, I think. And then when we go over here to the market. Uh, let's see here, which... Oh, I don't want to do it from this interface. I want to do it from this interface, right? Scroll, scroll, scroll. Uh, food stall, add somebody. And good stall, add somebody. Miners, we don't need any more. Ah, iron smelters. One, two. And the coal hut, I think I assigned to. Two of three woodcutters assigned. Whoops. Another one. How are we doing as far as unemployed goes? That's it. I've used them all up. Luxury stalls, we weren't going to assign to anyway. Stonemason? I assigned... Oh, I built two stonemason huts. Only one of them's been assigned so far. No problem. Alright, male 1528. No. Female 1106. You are also a stonemason. 
And you should be this hut, right? Yes, you are. Good. Okay. Good, good, good. So I'm staring at this house again and I'm noticing that... Um, why are you building a walkway so close here? Remember I put this fence over here. And that... Remove this walkway, which is kind of cool because notice how the the grass grows back, right? And uh, yeah, that looks really cool. But now you're out here doing this thing. I am not beyond putting another fence up. That's what I'm saying. All right, that looks uh, that looks good. Let's put up a decorative tree because we're here. Right? And, uh, yeah, we're here. And we want a couple of decorative trees here. There we go. And there, and then there. Okay. Blacksmith is complete. And we have two unemployed. One of them will go to... No, both of them will go to the blacksmith. Perfect. The coal hut is complete. And how are we doing down in here? You're making weapons about as fast as you can. You've got 12 weapons stored because we don't have any warehouse for weapons yet. But you've only made 12 out of the 100 you could potentially make. And we can sell these. So hold the phone. Tools, wood. How about we turn one of these into weapons? Let's weaponize this warehouse. There. And then how about we say trade weapons. I want to sell all above zero. I want to sell every... Yeah, I want to sell every weapon we make. There's no reason to keep the weapons. So just sell them. Sell them all. For cash. Yes, all 15 are sitting in the warehouse. Which means when our friendly bald trader guy comes, here he is. There he is. He's always there. He's like Savoir Fair. And how many are you gonna buy? All right. He's not the guy that buys. What? Do you, what? What is it you do here? Uh, you're the glass guy, and the herb guy. Okay. All right. So here is. The weaponsmith house. And of course he's not working. Why is he working? I don't know. Because I want to see him work. Let's slow it down a bit. Maybe he'll show up eventually for work. Maybe. I got time. I got time. I'm going to wait until you show up. Alright. I think this weaponsmith needs his butt kicked. Because I don't know where he is. I'm on free time. Going to fetch some resources. Okay. I just want to say, this is the face of a slacker. Right there. That's what a slacker looks like. I could use other words that this guy looks like, but we'll be, we'll try to be nice about it. You're going to drop it off, and then you're going to work? He's working. He's actually working. It's incredible. We're filming it right there. He's making one or two weapons. He's going to take a break in just a second to fulfill his needs. Alright, and now... Yeah, the blacksmith is working. They're both working. They are both working. <laughs> so, now, I can say... There you go. Blacksmith, weaponsmith. Hard at work. Never doubted him for a minute. You worked. Alright, alright. You had to pick up more stuff. I can see that. So now, Weaponsmith, Blacksmith, they're good. They're good. Anyway, uh, that's it for now. Next time, Monastery. And, uh, oh, there were two of you working over there. All right. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later. It's a bald trader guy. Again. It just seems like I'm forgetting something. Was there something else I was going to do? What is it I'm forgetting? If I could just fit another one in, that would be ideal. Alright, that's just that's just the way it is. The, the whole thing was a problem, we need to do it again. 
uh, that's a that's a good start. We turn the corner there, and uh, we're kind of continuing our little fort-like arrangement. And of course, we bow out like this because we wanted to save the trees, right? And uh, yeah, that's that's just the way it is. <laughs> There's a lot of people going to this church. Uh, it only says one of 99, but uh, this traffic is insane. Absolutely insane. Anyway, I think that looks good for the next edition. So I can start this. And I feel so much better now. I feel so much better. I feel like, I feel like all is right with the world. Uh, there we go. Anyway, there we are. There's where we were, way over there. There's the, uh, the new weaponsmith is over there. And, um, right. So now, that's all good. And, uh, yes, the church is under construction again as I end the episode. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.